demonstrators with the Valley of Change sit outside the Sherman Oaks Galleria celebrating not just President-elect Joe Biden's victory, but Senator Kamala Harris becoming the first woman and person of color to serve as the next Vice President of the United States. She has that spunk and she's well spoken and she's smart and intelligent and she does the right thing for everyone. I can't wait to see what she continues to do. She's going to do huge things. The, the fact that little girls can look on TV of any race and say, hey, I can do that, but especially people of color. The California native rose to success after graduating from a historically black college, eventually becoming California's first female attorney general and an accomplished U.S. senator. She's also the proud daughter of Jamaican and Indian immigrants. Her victory resonates with State Senator Holly Mitchell, who just won a seat on the L.A. County Board of Supervisors, which will now be run by all women for the first time in history. For women and women of color and black women to be able to conceive and perceive that there are no limitations for us is absolutely liberating and empowering and right on time and I am thrilled. Thrilled the vice president-elect has shattered the glass ceiling, becoming second in command. Harris's sister also beaming with pride on Twitter. She shared a picture of their deceased mother and wrote, Mommy taught us we could be and do anything. She would be beyond proud today. Governor Gavin Newsom also tweeted, My dear friend and now Madam Vice President-elect, congratulations. California is so, so proud today. Supporters say while Harris is a symbol of strength and perseverance, there's still a lot of work to be done when it comes to the fight for equality. In Sherman Oaks, Candace Crone, KCAL 9 News.